Hey guys, Ricardo here. Welcome to another Block Tech Tips. And of course today guys, I'm going to show you how to, as seen on screen here, how to actually translate any um, Android recovery that's in the Chinese language or it could be another language as well. So if you have both into the recovery of your, and you're seeing in the menu where it is in a, where the menu is in a strange language that you do not, or you're unable to read, simply follow these steps and using these steps you should be able to deal with the problem now to start off guys the first thing you need to do is make sure you're connected to the internet and what you'll need you'll need a particular tool so just go to google play store once you're in the google play store go ahead and search for google translate and once you find google translate go ahead and install i've already pre-installed once it's installed go ahead and open now once you open in this case as seen on screen earlier you saw that strange language and that particular language was actually chinese so you can do two things either once connected in it set the option to detect language automatically or you can actually choose the language if you know what it is in my case it was um, chinese so i've gone ahead and select chinese and i've set the um, translation to english and once more, there might be a file that you need to download. If so, it should appear down here. Just go ahead and hit that. It should download. Once it downloads, <clears throat> next, what you're going to do is you're going to um, take the secondary phone, which with the Google Translate, you're going to actually hit the camera and hit the camera and then, of course, point it at the, and it should translate what's on screen. Once you translate what's on screen, you'll then be able to, um, read what the options are on screen and all you have to do is use volume up and down to navigate as well as power to select and keep translating until the device is reset or you find the option that you want in Android recovery. Next I'll be showing you how to actually do that on the real device using this phone. Alright guys so as seen here this is the tablet in question and what we're doing here is that we're showing you how to do it. Again here's my phone and this is a tablet so this applies to tablets it could also be applied to phones it doesn't really matter and we're going to translate using google translate as i showed you earlier and here we go so what we're going to do here is that we're just going to select the chinese as i showed you and of course now that we have selected the chinese and updated and so on we're going to translate this screen that's in the background on the tablet and of course here we go we tap the camera and of course here we go here and it's going to translate from chinese to English and as you can see this is what every option is showing it's essentially you keep the camera in a fixed position and as you see there you have erase user data in the middle there and of course there's erase buffer backup user data application backup for user data and of course there are all the other options there everything is translated perfectly and using this now I can actually reset if I want to or clear the cache or do anything that's shown here in menu all right, guys, so this has been Ricardo from Gardner from Blog Tech Tips showing you how to use Google Translate to actually translate almost any screen, especially on tablets and so on. It's Ricardo Gardner from Blog Tech Tips. Bye until next time. Bye.